The women were scouring the bush for food in northern Burkina Faso when unknown men fired gunshots and closed in. That was a week ago. Burkinabe authorities say that on January 12th and 13th, around 50 women were kidnapped. Now, some are back in their hometown Arbinda, having managed to escape. They have asked to remain anonymous, fearing for their safety. We thought we had to take a risk. The lucky ones will be able to escape. I took the risk to escape in the little forest nearby with my child. I arrived back at home at around 10 p.m. When I think of the others who stayed there, I can't sleep. I don't know what happened to them. Are they going to survive? I asked myself a lot of questions. When I escaped, I fell. I walked on thorns and rocks, and that's how I injured my foot. This 25-year-old says they were walked through the bush for a whole day. She managed to escape with her daughter. But she says others were too scared to run and many were younger than her daughter. The kidnapping took place in Soon province, a hotbed of jihadist activity. It might be a new tactic from insurgents whose brutal attacks have blighted Burkina Faso. While Westerners and locals are occasionally taken, women have not previously been abducted in such numbers. In Arbinda on Tuesday, protesters marched to ask authorities to send more food. Provisions were later airdropped.